Okay, so I'm um, gonna test this out in just a second. You see we're getting a little bit of data at the moment. And I think the it's a little hard to watch this with the VR camera view. So I've actually added in the spectator cam just so I can get something a little more uh, reasonable. <laughs> okay, let's put this on and see how we do. Okay, so here I am uh, just speaking and looking around and you can see I'm able to tilt my head and we've got some nice hair going on here. And uh, I keep peeking out of the headset so you can kind of see what's going on there. But I've added a few more curves to try to get everything working here. I think I've also made some progress with multiplayer. So I've got kind of a, a little dummy container that takes in all these different curve data things and starts to uh, put them in a, in a system that can replicate across different Unreal Engine instances. But, you know, I, I think we're making some progress here. The whole goal here is to try to get a, a really good looking metahuman to start to use these values and uh, to obviously allow someone like a performer to actually be inside virtual reality and uh, make eye contact with the people they're performing with and uh, look <laughs> look really good while doing it and get as much expressivity as possible. So I definitely want to keep modifying some of the curves here. Like you see some of them are better than others. My teeth tend to come up pretty quick. Let me do a smile, but they also can come up in other situations as well. Still no tongue, that. But uh, yeah, you know, I think we're making some good progress here. Feels feels good to be uh, doing this kind of thing and getting it all to render out in real time. Um, and I guess I'll just keep you updated with progress. Thanks, hey. And I, I. Uh, yeah, you know, just kind of getting through here and uh, trying out some some new curves and seeing how all this is registering. Uh, we've got some better lighting going on here and I've got the head rotation going. I can uh, move my mouth a little bit more uh, fully, but I need to adjust some of the curves here because my teeth are showing a lot. Smile is fine, but you know, other situations we might not want quite as much teeth action going on. Uh, but you know, I think this is progress. I think this is looking pretty good. And I think we'll just keep going. So you know, thanks for checking it out. I think I got some multiplayer support on the way as well, which is exciting. And you know, come see Christmas Carol. <laughs> I got kind of a sneer going on, a little bit like, mm, I don't know how I feel about this. Mm, mm. That's okay though. Okay. Oh, hello there. Um, hey, it's me, Alex, just testing out some metahuman curves and doing some very accentuated mouth movements and eye blinking and eye looking around stuff just to see what we're getting here from inside a VR headset. The benefit here, of course, being that we can look around and see people, make eye contact with people from within VR. Really cool if you're a, say, performer and, uh, you know, just working on things like finer mouth movements nose wiggles, eyebrow wiggles, and making progress, I think. Even though I've got kind of a perpetual sneer going on here, it's okay, it's okay. That might be, you know, like mask work. It's just something that's part of the character. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep plugging away at it. So thanks. Yeah. Looks kind of like I'm at a spa right now. <laughs> 